the process of trying to take anything that you know and show it to somebody else makes you understand it in a, on a deeper level. So, you know, with a lot of what the students do, especially in my pedagogy class, I'll, I'll kind of challenge them to, all right, well, now think about how you would present that to somebody else and make it very clear. And then if you're still kind of not seeing the light go on, what can you do in the way of taking a different view of that from another angle or a different set of relationships that could possibly make the light go on for that person? It's an interesting challenge. It's one of the most rewarding things about doing this specifically when you can come up with the other point of view and make the light go on. We don't teach, I mean, we don't focus specifically on just teaching, but a huge part of what we talk about is teaching either privately or teaching classes or teaching clinics, or now um, some of our students are being hired to go in and do small, uh, very specialized presentations on camera for projects that are online guitar education sort of settings. So they have a very specific script that either they've crafted or that they're working with from the people that they happen to be hired by. And in a lot of cases, it's very, very concise in terms of they have X amount of minutes to do this. They're being filmed in an environment where they're wearing um, some kind of, uh, I forget what, what the process is called, but it's like a, a video capture thing that allows them to be on this website in a very sort of very current state-of-the-art kind of computer animated kind of almost setting and uh, the students that have actually participated in this have really learned a lot about what it is to be able to first of all either maybe read a script or second of all craft a script that is very specifically designed to be over within 10 minutes you know what I mean so it's, it's a very sort of specialized area of teaching but those are some of the things that we get involved in um, in the pedagogy classes. Well, what was that like? How did you prepare for that? What were the uh, unforeseen circumstances that led to either problems or things that were sort of unexpected um, circumstances that came at you? And uh, in addition to the traditional teaching settings of just, you know, private lesson kind of setting or classroom setting.